we'll be setting up our phone to an IDE with Termux, NeoVim, with LazyVim. Auto completion, syntax highlighting, etc. works, and we can compile and run a program. First, install Termux. This is a fresh install of Termux. I only changed the font with the Termux styling app. Run package update or upgrade. This is going to take quite a while. Install CMake. This is going to install Clang as well. Install NeoVim. Nightly is recommended for noise.nvim. Install git to clone LazyVim. Now let's follow the LazyVim installation guide. Let's open NeoVim now. LazyVim should be set up after some time. LazyVim is set up, but there are still problems we need to fix. Create a file. You will see some errors. Run check help. It seems like we are missing a lot of packages, so let's install them using package install. Now let's open NeoVim again. Most errors should be fixed, though if you open Mason with colon Mason and install language servers, some might fail to install. For instance, Lua or C++. If it displays this error, you'll have to install the LSP server manually and set up a workaround. Install the LSP server for the language you want with package install. I will be installing the LSP server for Lua. Create a new Lua file in the following directory. The name can be whatever you want. We will be overriding the config function of nvim lsp config. Copy the config part from the following link. Paste it here. Near the end, add the servers you want to set up like this. I will be setting up the server for Lua. The LSP server should work now. This is a very bad workaround, so please let me know if there's a fix for this, or a better workaround. Let's set up another language server that cannot be installed with Mason on my phone, for example, ClangGD. We can add this line here. ClangGD is already installed, so it'll start working. I barely covered anything about LazyVim itself, because there is already a great video. The only reason I made this video was to send this to my friend who kept asking me about this. If you're watching this, here you go. Now please stop asking me to fix your errors at 4am.